something a little bit different. We are actually leaving the stomping grounds of our house that we've been in for the past half a year, I would say. <laughs> our stomping grounds? Our stomping grounds, the old stomping grounds. And we're heading towards an area that none of us have ever been before, even though it's only two and a half hours away. We are going to the Prince Edward County area and we are specifically going there because we have a wedding in Wapus. One of our childhood best friends is actually getting married at this beautiful winery it looks like so we decided to make the weekend of it. So today's Saturday we are pretty much going to check into our Airbnb, get ready for the wedding and then we are off. I will take you to the winery. It will be really nice and then we have a couple fun things hopefully planned for this weekend weather permitting. So yeah I'm really excited to take you around the Prince Edward County area and we are staying in Picton which is like one of the main hubs of the area. So yeah, I'm really excited for our little weekend getaway. This is the closest I'll get to a vacation. So looking forward to it, right? <laughs> Drinking under a tree near a tractor. Very appropriate for these guys, wouldn't you say? <laughs> this is what I'm wearing for the wedding. I think we all cleaned up well. I will show you everyone else right now. I'm wearing a blue dress. It might look black, but it's blue. Matches Nikita's suit. Where is he? Hi, you look so handsome. You're a stunner. I love it. Ta da! No way. Everyone Hi. cleans up well. Aw, you guys Hi. look so cute. We ready. Adorbs. So, who was the last ones ready? Jules and Ada, right? The Waputh Winery. Let's get our drink on. Gloss and a mask is gonna be not a good idea, but what can you do? So we were just informed that this was a Saval grape. Yeah. Good question, babe. <laughs> <laughs> so we are at the Waputh Winery in Waputh, and this is where the ceremony is going to take place. And we're the first ones here, so we can take some pictures. But it's beautiful. I hope you can hear me from the wind, but it's so lovely here. A winery by the lake, Lake Ontario. Breeze here, eh? Our first wedding together. Okay. Congratulations, Vanny! Vanny and Attic. Another Attic, believe it or not. We're so happy for Vanessa, Vanny. Congratulations, so Vanny and Attic. It's beautiful here. It's this gorgeous, is going to be guys. gorgeous. What a venue. What a, what a venue. venue. Everything's outdoors. Yeah. I, so, it's like, crazy. We're trying to get the guys to take a picture. How beautiful is this? I highly recommend checking out this vineyard because we're right by the water. Is Vanny here or no? I'm filming, so say hi. This is the bride. <laughs> Honestly, this actually feels like a normal wedding. Yeah. It feels like beautiful. There's like a sense of, there's a sense of normal okay. here. Hey, Danny, congrats. Congratulations, Danny. Yes, you are married. And now, as your guests respond, please kiss your bride, please kiss your husband. Let them know.
Good morning, guys. So needless to say, yesterday was a success. The wedding was beautiful. The winery was stunning. The location was stunning. We almost felt like quarantine did not exist, even though we still kept our distance from people. I mean, it was just a really good time. So lovely, so nice to see my friends and even their family members that I haven't seen in a long time. And I got to introduce this one to everyone too. It was so nice. He has a headache today, right? Mm. <laughs> um, after after a lovely a night, night. <laughs> after an open bar, so it was really nice. Highly recommend checking out the Wapoos Estates Winery, guys. So beautiful. And actually, their house wine, which was the red, was actually really good. Stains your teeth like crazy, but it was actually super good. Considering when we went to Niagara on the lake, we had the Niagara wines and we weren't that crazy about them So I would say the wine is actually better here. So today we are heading off to I think Lake on the Mountain So we'll see what that holds at this place called the Miller House and right now we are on a lake on the mountain or lake Whoa, on a mountain wait. or something like that Where am I looking? and it looks yeah. so cute here and this place is first come first serve so you can't make reservations this is stunning isn't it love it how yeah. cute is this yeah. you know that this lake yeah lake on, yeah. This side, on this side yeah is on top of the mountain yeah 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 whereas this yeah. is Lake Ontario oh Lake on okay so this is Lake Ontario this and this is the lake on the lake mountain on the mountain Wow huh? Very okay, cool. good to know. Yeah, love it. Love it, eh? Yeah. Very nice. Something that uh, looks like uh, from a film of Christopher Nolan. <laughs> Scenic. <you know. laughs> Does it? Yeah. <sighs> so cute. Uh, look at this tree. Beautiful. They have platters with these cheese and meat platters. They have tart flambés and there are tartines and there's also these little petite things to have. Oh, they even have dessert and this is the actual menu for the ciders and red wines and beers and things like that. So it looks pretty good. This is our lovely view. And it's really hot today, guys. We were not prepared, right? Now we're prepared, we're excited to just relax. It's really beautiful, and we've had a good night last night, so we're just ready to take it easy today. And sitting in this weather. <laughs> yeah, the two champs over here, right? Tweedledee and Tweedledum. I'm, I'm retired. Oh, hello. <laughs> I'm retired. Mm. What are you guys getting? We're gonna get. I'm gonna get a glass of rosé. Are you? What are you gonna get? So this is one of the local charcuterie boards with their local meats and salamis, local cheese, local, I think, a bacon jam, I think? This looks like a grainy mustard and some bread. Looks delicious, and I really love this dry, sparkling white wine. It's really delicious. And this is a tart flambe. I've actually had this in Strasbourg, France before, and it is famous in that Alsace region of France. So it's basically like a flatbread with a creamy spread on top. I believe they use creme fresh there and then there's always bacon and onions so and this is a chicken liver mousse yum cheers bon appetit cheers, cheers. <laughs> oh yeah the pimento cheese you got i want to try that that looks good <laughs> and they got the favorite board On a mountain this is the actual little mini lake we're at lake on a mountain lake on a mountain lovely sort of fresh in the shade even even though it's like feels like 33 today very nice totally uh, pull out a kayak Ooh, that's it it's so pretty behind us we're lucky with weather <laughs> i'm lucky with you Aww, cute, cute, cute. So guys, right now we are at the Cider House. We just left the Lake on a Mountain area because there was really only those two restaurants in that area. So we're back in the Wapoos area and we came to the Cider Company. It's pretty much right across from the winery that we were at yesterday. I think we want to see the winery again today because they had like a cute yeah, gift shop and things that we didn't get to see while we were at the wedding. It's really cute so here, guys. Really nice. Everywhere you go, there's just little cute shops and wineries. So it's very nice. It's very cute. Absolutely. Oh, 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 oh. 
I would definitely love to be here in the fall when it's fresh and crisp out. Right now it's just really hot, but it's so pretty and beautiful. Just being by the water is just really nice. What more can you ask for? We got a nice gelato. We came back to the Wapoos Winery area. So we just got to the Oyster and Pearl restaurant. And what do you say, babe? Looks like a hidden gem. Yeah. <laughs> Like a so pearl in the oyster, <laughs> sitting in the middle of Prince Edward County. No one would know about it. It's so cute. <laughs> I'm ready for oysters. Yeah. The menu, oyster bar, fresh oysters. Ooh. Sand and Pearl in Prince Edward Bar. County and Daniel, well I've never tried an oyster before and I don't really think I'm going to like that. We'll do something new and try yeah. one together. I haven't so, had one yet, so. So we might do that. We're definitely having oysters. We do it all together. We're going to do it all together. Are you guys ready? ready? Yeah. Cheers. Cheers. One, two, three. Cheers. Buddy, don't worry. Mm. It's not as bad as I thought. It doesn't really taste like anything. We'll it's the consistency. <laughs> On a scale of one to ten, I wouldn't do it again. I mean, I, I would never order oysters no. again in my life. But it was okay. It, was an it wasn't as bad as I thought. What are they? What are they talking about? They don't know what they're missing. I don't understand. Is this another one? What they're missing? Oh, oh thanks. This is why I do not get any oysters. <laughs> and this is our Dorito ceviche, and it's so adorable. And I snuck a piece, and it's actually yeah. delicious. Yeah. Daniel here like to remind us that Af <laughs> oysters are aphrodisiacs. So he said these two are gonna get, they're eating a lot of oysters. So I'm gonna be doing uh, funky things tonight. Yeah. Oh my god! Cheers. This is a family. Love you. This is a family. that one. How did that one taste? Mm. Fresh. In my favorite. That one. Mm -hmm. Uh, what? What, so which one is it, do you know? No. I tend to like the flat ones, I feel like. Oh. What are these buttes doing? Hey, look at this guy know. over here. He loves being videotaped. He loves being on these vlogs. We're excited for I'm our excited lobster, for the lobster roll, roll. I do like lobster. Yes, mm. so we're very excited. And it's so cute here, guys. Yeah. It's like very a, cute. Like a little picnic-y atmosphere. It's like hipster-ish, but it's very cute. So we're splitting the burger so far mm. with some fries. Mm. And it's actually yeah, really delicious. Really oh yeah, I'm waiting for my lobster roll. It's very good. Mm. Mm. Did you bucks. tell I didn't know? This is my yeah, real dessert, right? Sorry. Right here. That was your real dessert. And look how cute it is right now here. Mood lighting. Yeah. Yeah. So cute. Hey guys. <laughs> Okay. This meal was really good. We had so much fun here. It's our last full night in PEC, Prince Edward County. <laughs> and we really enjoyed our meal. Oh, well. Hi! We are at the Drake Devonshire Inn for a brunch, and it's gorgeous here. It's a hot day, and it's fresh. The lake is right here. Very fresh, very early. <laughs> so we have their famous blueberry scones with sweet cream and our cappuccinos with this view. So stunning guys, so beautiful. Guys, right now I feel like I'm on vacation and that says a lot because we've been stuck inside our house for pretty much six months. And this is amazing. It's such a beautiful view that you cannot leave. You see? Yeah. How beautiful this is. Oh my gosh, they filmed that. That is so pretty. Oh my gosh, that looks really cute. They ordered their lavender lemonade, I believe. It's like an alcoholic drink for breakfast. You can tell who's not driving today, right? <laughs> okay, so give it a mix and enjoy. The non-designated driver. The non-DD. <laughs> we recommend the blueberry scones. As you can see, we did not like them at all. <laughs> the cream was just as good yeah, as The clotted cream. It's kind of that Devonshire cream. And this drink tastes like um, the blueberries come just in a lot of form. Wow! <laughs> Too bad that Jen and Dan couldn't join us. I know. They, had to leave early, so they would have loved it here. And this is a little bit special for Attic and I because we met at the Drake in Toronto. Oh, yeah. Right, babe? <laughs> Very cute. This is, I believe, it's the sister company. Is that what it is? The sister property. This is the sister property of the Drake downtown Toronto, and this is in Prince Edward County. But Guys, we love these scones. They're so delicious. Yeah. You just plopped it all on top. Bye. Enjoy. <laughs> <laughs> and I cut mine actually in half with my cappuccino. This is my ideal breakfast, guys. Honestly, ideal. 
We're on holiday. <laughs> it's lovely. Beautiful view, delicious food. So far. Yeah. And, good. and dirty pants. Oysters by the water, guys. Can you go wrong? Some lemon. We got a little sauce there that you pour it in. Cheers, babe. <laughs> you guys should have wrapped your arms around each other and fed each other. I got the moules frites, which is very typical in Belgium. Mussels and fries. Jules got herself a nice burger. Ada got fish and chips and moules frites. <laughs> and Nikita got steak frites. Looks very delicious, guys. So bon appetit. Anything they can serve us would still be good because we have this view. I just adore this place. Okay guys, before I forget to end the vlog, I just wanted to say thank you so much for following along. This was of course our first time in Prince Edward County and we loved it. I would say the highlights of our trip were the beginning and the end. So definitely that winery, not even just for the wedding, but if you're going there, just in general, that was probably the best winery. We of course had a great time because of the wedding, but that was definitely our favorite winery that we saw. So that was the Wapoos Estates Winery. And also we ended the trip on a great note at the Drake Devonshire hotel and in a state whatever they call it it was just stunning we absolutely loved it and dining by the water was so nice thank you guys for watching and if you enjoyed this please thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more videos bye